Hello friends! For the longest time, people have perceived nature as an inexhaustible source of materials we needed. However, faced with the negative consequences of our impact on nature, we now try to correct our mistakes. But is there a chance to save life on planet Earth? Mark was used to walking his dog along the coastline at dawn. Every day, in any weather, he walked around a small stretch of the coast of his native island. That morning, there was a whale lying on one of the small beaches of the city. A huge carcass spread out on a narrow strip of sand, blocking the view of the horizon. Mark decided to come closer. But having taken a couple of steps, he was horrified. The man immediately called the Animal Rescue Service. The news that the body of a pregnant sperm whale was found in Porto Servo quickly spread on the internet. The autopsy revealed that there were 22 kilograms of plastic debris in the animal's stomach. Sergio Costa, Minister of the Environment of Italy, spoke about this incident on his Facebook page. Is there someone who still thinks that this isn't an important problem? I think it's important and it's a priority for me," the minister added. For many years, humanity has been enjoying the comfort of disposable plastic products, dishes and packaging, but it is the animals who pay for our comfort and they pay with their lives," added Costa. Unfortunately, the sperm whale was pregnant. The body length of the deceased animal was 8 meters. Veterinarians determined that it was the whale's first pregnancy. The two-meter fetus died before the mother. According to a preliminary report, the cause of death of both was the plastic debris. Pipes, garbage bags, nylon fishing lines, and a liquid laundry detergent container that had the brand name and a barcode on it were found in the whale's stomach, the eyewitnesses said. In the coming days, the Italian Council of Ministers will receive a bill obliging fishermen to bring all the plastic that gets caught in the fishing nets to the shore. Who would have thought that under the current law they are required to throw it back into the sea? In 2021, the EU will ban the use of single-use plastic utensils and straws. According to the European Commission, up to 80% of all garbage in the world's oceans is plastic waste. Sperm whales are the only representatives of their kind and the largest mammals among the toothed whales. An adult female can reach a length of 15 meters and a weight of 20 tons. Males are much larger. Their body length reaches 20 meters and their weight can exceed 50 tons. These marine giants feed mainly on deep-sea squid, rays, octopuses, and consume up to 900 kilograms of food per day. However, plastic is increasingly becoming part of their diet. Unfortunately, this case is not unique. Once in a while, there is news in the media around the world about whales that have been beached with stomachs full of garbage bags. Moreover, sperm whales aren't the only whales that fall prey to the plastic diet. Last year, a male beaked whale got beached on the Philippine coast. The whale was found off the coast of Sitio Asinan. It had 40 kilograms of plastic in its stomach, including 16 empty rice bags, four bags from banana plantations, and a few ordinary bags from supermarkets. Scientists believe that that was the cause of the animal's death. They noted that they had never seen so much plastic in the stomach of a whale before. This is terrible. The government needs to take action against those who still believe that bodies of water can be used as garbage cans, activists say. Nature is the human's environment and the source of our existence. So we're not just destroying everything around us, we're also destroying ourselves. And that's all for today, friends. Share your thoughts about this video in the comments below. Hit the like button and don't forget to share this video with your friends.
Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.